Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial. Today we are going to see how to start Docker containers automatically after a reboot. So this is useful when you need to have your container always running, even if the host machine restarts for some reason. So let's uh, start by creating two running containers um, and one will have configuration to enable uh, it to restart even if the host machine stops and the other one will be a normal container without that uh, configuration. In the end we will restart the host and you'll verify that only one container that had that configuration restarted with success, the other one was kept stopped. So let's do docker run dash d for daemon. Let's give in a name web1. Okay, and now let's give it a restart policy called unless stop. This means this container will restart every time except if you stop it manually otherwise it will always restart so let's choose a port dash p 8001 to 80 and let me copy the, um, the image name so no mistakes here awesome one container is running so let's create another one but let's call it web2 let's remove the restart policy and let, let's map it to a different port great so if you if you go to your web browser let's go to localhost 8001 it's running 8002 it's also running so far so good right uh, now let's do something Let's do docker ps to see our containers running. And we have those two running, web1 and web2. Let's do something called docker inspect. And let's inspect web1. It was the one that we gave the restart policy, okay? If you search here, you will see a restart policy configuration and it says unless stop okay so if you if you go to the other one and inspect it so web2 no restart policy should be there see so it won't restart never there are other restart policies, um, so th there is a no restart policy and this is the default value and it means that the container will not be restarted, never. On failure, on dash failure, this will restart the container in case that there is an error and the container crashes. Sometimes this is useful and it is enough. Ne then you have uh, unless stopped the container will always be restarted unless it was manually manually stopped this is the restart policy that we are applying now and there is the last one which is always it will always restart the container if it stops it the reason doesn't matter always restarts so let's go then so always will also work here on failure won't work and no won't work as well so let's do now docker ps confirm that two are running now let's kill our um, docker host okay it is restarting uh, it might take up a while okay so now docker is restarted and now it's running so let's do docker ps 
and our web one which had our restart policy um, should be running and the other one should not moment of true yes our web one is running and the other one is not so if you go to port one it will open up if you go to two it it didn't okay so that's it if you want you just need to change your um, policy uh, to whatever you want <clears throat> there is another thing that you can do you can update the policy so you can do docker update restart policy right and you can do like always let's change this and container id so if you do docker inspect our container id you'll see that the restart policy was updated to always so you can this way restart uh, change the restart policy of a running container without stopping it so and this is the end of the the tutorial it was very simple so now you know how to start docker containers automatically after the docker host reboots